What is going on guys? This is going to be my final match preview video until my big prediction video uh, for WrestleMania tomorrow. It's going to be going up on my channel, of course. Uh, so this one is going to be discussing the main event, the WWE World Heavyweight Championship match uh, between the champion Brock Lesnar and the number one contender, the challenger, the Royal Rumble winner, Roman Reigns. Now, a lot of people are very upset still that this is happening. Uh, and don't get me wrong, I'm not big on it either. But, as I've said in my last video, I'm looking forward to WrestleMania as a whole, so one match is not going to diminish, you know, my excitement for the show, like, oh, Roman Reigns is getting a title shot, now I'm completely uninterested. It's totally not how I'm looking at this. Uh, I'm looking at, I'm going into this thinking that there's a small chance, honestly, that Roman Reigns will win. I know Roman Reigns has accomplished tons of accolades in the past you know, year and a half, whatever. Uh, I think he eliminated four out of the five people of a Survivor Series team in 2013. Of course, he broke the record uh, of most eliminations in one Royal Rumble match with 12. He won the Royal Rumble this year. He's been WWE Tag Team Champions. The accolades are just stacking up for him, and he's superstar the superstar of the year in 2014. Uh, so, you know, WWE's really obviously pushing him down. Or throats, unfortunately, and I just, I don't think, honestly, that WWE's going to put the title on him. I think it's either Lesnar's going to walk out or Seth Rollins is, I think Seth Rollins, honestly, has the best chance of walking out uh, as WrestleMania champion. Roman Reigns will definitely get it down the line. I think SummerSlam's the best place for him to get it, but not now. Not where he's going to get booed out of the stadium, no doubt. Especially since, you know, people aren't going to be upset that all oh, Lesnar's leaving or anything like that because Lesnar's announced he's staying he's resigned everyone the majority of that crowd is definitely going to be behind Lesnar so I, I don't know if Roman Reigns wins I'm not going to I'm, I'm going to be a little upset but you know at the same time I, I don't know and Seth Rollins he has to cash in eventually you know he's got two months or a little over two months he's got till June so Wrestlemania is a perfect time to cash in how I would do it is at least the match itself first off would just, you know, it has to be a brawl. It has to be a believable where whether Rollins catches in after or not, whether who wins between Reigns or not, it at least looks like Reigns, you know, is doing a lot of damage to Brock. If Lesnar can survive, you know, beating, or what was I trying to say? If Lesnar can survive, curb stomps, uh, AAs, going through a barricade, hit with steel steps, hit with the money in the bank, going through the announce table, and more at the Royal Rumble, and breaking his rib at the Royal Rumble and walking out champion against John Cena and Seth Rollins, Roman Reigns needs to do a lot to Lesnar to make it believable that Reigns might win the title. Whether it's through the announce table, spear through the, you know, barricade, other weapons included, we'll see what happens. But they need to. It needs to be that. If it's just a normal, you know, we'll see a spear two, a Superman punch or two, and Reigns happens to walk out champion. It's not going to be believable. It's just going to make people hate Roman Reigns even more. Uh, to talk about the build for this match, I think Paul Heyman has done a great job, obviously, uh, at getting pretty much everybody uh, at least a little excited for this match. I know a lot of people were upset, and so was I, with the uh, the ending of Raw this past Monday, where I was hoping you know we were going to get some kind of interaction, physical interaction between you know Roman Reigns and Brock Lesnar. We didn't. We got a, a tug of war over the WWE title. So that was disappointing, but Paul Heyman has, himself has done a great job of hyping this up over, you know, mic seals and promos and whatnot. Uh, the uh, backstage interview that they did with Lesnar like two weeks ago uh, that they aired where he said he's going to F up Roman Reigns at WrestleMania. That's great. Uh, and some of the stuff they've been doing with Roman Reigns as well, some of the promos and whatnot. You know, it's been good. The night after the Royal Rumble where they had the, uh, the Raw, Raw snowed in at uh, WWE headquarters, that whole Roman Reigns, Paul Heyman, Lesnar segment, it was great, so, you know, talking-wise, this has been a great build, obviously, we haven't seen any physical interaction, saving that for WrestleMania, like I said, hopefully, Reigns does damage to Lesnar, so, at least, if Reigns is going to win the title, it's believable to that, I still don't think Roman Reigns will walk out champion, I may be totally proven wrong, maybe he will, maybe he won't, we'll see, it's, for me, it's Seth Rollins, Lesnar and Roman Reigns are kind of tied for second on who's going to walk out champion. But there's my final match preview uh, for WrestleMania. I have all my other ones uploaded on my channel, all uh, in a playlist. So go check them all out. So 
is pretty much it. I got my WrestleMania 31 predictions tomorrow. And uh, yeah, that's it. One more thing I want to mention though, to in an effort to get more subs and views here on YouTube, I would like to say that if anybody watching this video cares to tweet out this video, post it anywhere on social media, as long as you tag me in it and I see it, or at least tell me about it, show me proof of it, I'll make sure to mention you, your Twitter, your YouTube channel, whatever, give you some kind of plug, shout out in a YouTube video. So share this video for me, help me get you know my subs up, my views up, and I will help you out in return with you know followers or subscribers also so just letting you guys know just make sure I'm, I'm aware if you if you do you know don't let don't just tweet it out ask me why I didn't mention you because if I didn't see it I didn't see it you know make sure you know make sure I'm aware of what you did so that's gonna be this video uh, I'm gonna upload these a little later tonight so yeah see you guys in the next video see you tomorrow for WrestleMania 31 predictions